What's up guys, iNadio here. Um, I'm gonna show you today my Twixter settings since one of my mates asked me to do a tutorial on this. Uh, so here's what we're gonna create. Okay, so um, when you, once you're in After Effects, press Ctrl I and uh, import your clip. I will be using this. Um, <coughs> So uh, track it to an ingot position, and then um, you don't have to do this, but I, I'm going to do a uh, new adjustment layer for color correction. So I'm going to layer, new adjustment layer, and drag my color correction on it. <coughs> so now uh, select your video layer, and enable frame blending, then right click, uh, go to frame blending, and select pixel motion. And then uh, right click again, go to time, and enable time remapping. Uh, so now um, our composition is uh, the exact length of our original video clip. So when we're gonna slow it down, uh, it won't be long enough. So we're gonna go to composition and composition settings. And we're gonna extend the composition. I'm just gonna add 10 seconds to it. So there will be enough space for the slow motion. And now um, go to effect and version plugins Twixter. Um, change input frame rate to 59.94, which is the PVR frame, frame rate. And then um, drag up motion sensitivity up to 100. And uh, now um, click on this little stopwatch icon uh, right next to speed. And then go to effect here, Twixter, output control. And um, now, find where you want to uh, twix twixter to start and so I want to I want it to start right here so I'm gonna make a, a keyframe here and few frames after that I change speed to 2% so now um, it's gonna be a 100% until here it will be 2% speed and uh, I want the slow mo to end about um, here. So I'm gonna make a new keyframe here, this little button here, and a few frames after that, back to 100% speed. <coughs> so now um, let's just start with 100% speed, and then there's the slow motion, and back to 100% speed. But now you noticed um, the video ends here. That's because uh, the video isn't long enough, so we're gonna just drag it a bit longer. And uh, if you uh, like, are like having problems with this, um, it's be it's maybe because you forgot the time remap. And just gonna drag the adjustment layer a bit longer too. So now um, our clip ends here. So I'm gonna um, make the work area about that size. Um, now we're gonna go to um, Composition at Render Queue and um, just use the default lossless preset. Uh, if you want the audio, you can right click and select the audio input. But uh, when using Twixter, the audio isn't in sync, so I wouldn't recommend using this. And then just uh, select where you want it to be. Um, I want it to be on just on desktop. Um, <coughs> then just check out, you're just gonna hit render, and that's about it. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, if you have any questions, comment below, and um, I'll see you later. Bye.